Hello everyone, welcome to season 3, episode 8. I'm recording this literally just after I finish episode 7 because I want to get this season finished. I want to see if I keep my fucking job or not. I want to see if I can get into the knockout stages of the Europa League. And I want to see if I can do the double again. Alright, shall we get started then? Playing against Dundalk. Big game for us. Alrighty, so you can see the team there. Oh, Novak shouldn't be captain. Oh, right. Besides that, you can see the team. See what we're gonna go with. Uh, right. Let's get into this. My phone has gone off again. It's typical. Every single video, my phone goes off at some point. And uh, it's just a meme for the Leitai Plays channel. Even streams just go off. Right. I will play this. This is not being simmed. All right. Let's do this. We've just scored. Oh my god. Shit. What a goal. I. I didn't think that was gonna do anything. We got a random free kick at like the side of the pitch. And uh, we've just absolutely scored a great goal. Oh my god, that's that's fantastic. Oh you love to see that. Uh good header for McBride. Yeah, let's, let's just have a look at this for a sec. Good ball in. Good leap. Good header. One and up against the dog. As it stands, we're five points ahead of Bowes, but, you know, I don't know the result of their game. I don't even know if they're playing yet, so we'll just assume that they have a game in hand. Chance here for George McBride to score a free kick. He doesn't. And we could be in trouble here. Actually, he's been completely caught out. Oh, good block, Kearney. All right, not block. Good tackle, Ernie. Credit where credit's due. Oh, shit. Oh, good save. Yeah, I wasn't expecting that to get through that far. Oh, they've gotten it over Kennedy. Not good. Fucking it around my box. Good block from Kearney. That was an actual block this time. Come on, Marcy, you just gotta keep going. Oh, go on, Finley. Go on. No one there for him, except for Marcy. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. You'll love to see that. 2 0. But one game to go. This is good. You like to see this. You really do like to see this. Good ball into Martin. Good block from Kearney. They've given a penalty. What? How is that a pen? Against Novak? I 100% disagree. Oh, get over yourselves. That's not a pen. We've been absolutely cheated here. Yeah, we've been cheated out of our two goal lead. Now 2 1. That was just not a penalty. That was just EA at its finest. Using bullshit to prevent my. Title win. Giving a free kick here for absolutely nothing. Alright, half time, 2 1. Should be 2 0. But uh, EA are trying to sneak themselves into this game. Ball to Morrissey, but of course, in EA's eyes, it's over hit. Even though I tapped the fucking button. Should have been a perfect pass, but you know, you know what this game's like. Right. No, oh, that was supposed to go to Morrissey. Oh, EA are really starting to invest themselves into this game. They're really inserting themselves in there where they're not wanted. Holding on to the ball for an awful while here. I'm waiting for EA just to do this thing where they just have to make me give the ball back with a shit pass or a shit touch. That doesn't make sense. There we go. That's the pass. That's the pass that just randomly goes away. It was a nice simple pass and they just have to give it away. Golly. RC. I don't know why he done that. I don't know why he just... He stuttered for some reason. I don't know why. And he leans backwards. Of course he does. He wins the ball though, so I'll I'll give him that. 
Oh, that would have been a great ball to McBride. Oh, Finley's giving the ball back. Nice. He's handing it to them. Good work, Finley. Sarcasm is right there. Giving a fell against me. Yeah, for no reason. Now, don't resume the match. I'm trying to make subs, you dope. Alright. Kane, McLaughlin, Mullen, Duffy, and Correa are coming on for the last four minutes of this game. If we can last that long. We're from Cardona. Hold on to it. Hold on to it. Hold on to it. One minute left. Yes, there we go. Huge, huge win in this title race. Could be going down to the final whistle. Or, yeah, I suppose that's the thing. I was going to say the final day, but it could go down to that. I'm not sure if it will or not. And I want to give Morrissey a man of match. Um, he scored. Finley got an assist. Bruce got an assist. McBride scored. Sure, I'll, I'll give it to Morrissey. I, I don't really see why I wouldn't. So, uh, yeah, well done, Marcy. You are man the match with a 7.7. This is the scare record on Felix Aguirre. Uh, he's got a bit of pace on him. Um, that's about it. I thought he was like Falcao's regen or Bacchus regen, but I don't think so. Alright, lads, I'm just having a look at the table here, and we've won the league. We've won it by a point. Boas, for some reason, have played a game extra. In which they did beat Shelburne, but they must have drawn against... Yeah, they drew against UCD at home. Holy shit. Lads, we've just won the league. It doesn't matter the result of this game, so I'm not going to play it. I'll probably... I'll do a fancy sim, but I'm just going to... um. I'm, I'm just going to hop in at the last second and just, just do the title thing. Good work, lads. Good work, lads. Alright, half time, 1 0. I will be hopping into the game at a later point in the match. And I probably will give man the match as well, just for the sake of it. Might as well. Alright, time for me to hop in. 82nd minute. I'm going to give man the match because it's the last game of the season. I feel like we should. Regardless of the results. Well, as long as we don't lose. I will hand out a man the match. And it's unlikely that we're going to lose. Right, Cruz, McBride, Graf, Pagali and Kennedy are coming on. And I'm just going to boot the ball out of the play. Just so these subs can be made for the title celebrations. There we go, we just booted them out. And we're just going to sit back and just relax. And just watch... These title celebrations happen. Bit of lag there, not good. But save. Ref. Can we have this title celebration done, please? We're already going over time. And there we go. Ladies and gentlemen, the title has been won. Two years in a row. We love to see this. Although for some reason they're not celebrating. Like they won the title, they're just walking off the pitch. Are you even doing a title celebration? McBride's the only one that actually looks happy. Fuck happened here? Yeah, so okay, so there's just no title celebration. Maybe it's from the game that you actually win the league in. Maybe that's how you do it. Time to man the match. Obviously, I wasn't really playing the game. Yeah, you know, I know I said I'd give a man the match, but there's no title celebration, so it just feels a bit shit to do that. So I'm just not going to. <laughs> yeah, I only played like what five, six minutes. Yeah. Okay. Cool. Right. We're just not doing that then. Oh, I thought there'd be title celebrations. But anyway, um, here's the Europa League table at the moment. We have two games left. Four points clear in Molde. Who we play next? So that's big. And then we also play Royal Antwerp. A draw against both of them should be enough to get us. Through. Uh, in terms of the Premier Division, here we are. This is how the league finishes. 36 games played, obviously. 19 wins, 11 draws, 6 losses, 66 goals, 4. 41 against, not great. 25 goal difference and 68 points. 
I don't think that's my best one. Oh, I literally got 68 points last season, so it's joint best season. Interesting. All right, game against Mola. We're doing the same formation that we did against Leipzig, as that worked very well for us. And this is a must-win game for us. So, you can see the team there. It's honestly, I think, my strongest 11, with the exception of Kearney. But in this formation, strongest 11. Uh, all we need is Cronin, I think, and then... Um, there you go. Maybe even Cullen. But anyway, let's do this. Referee, that's a red, surely. No, only a yellow. Right from behind, ref. Oh, so the ball's white. My jersey's white. The pitch is white. I was not expecting it to be snowy. Imagine that. I wasn't expecting it to be snowy in Norway. Go on. Fernandez. Oh my god, you f Okay. Don't get mad. We still need him. Still a couple games that we need him for. There's no point insulting him yet. Bride just absolutely launches that and it was saved very well. Novak back into the box. Not very good. Fernandez. Oh, nearly. Nearly got on the end of that. Look okay, at the amount of space here, McBride. Oh, you should have finished that. Oh, there's no excuses. There is no excuses for that, McBride. What the fuck? They just gave McGauley so much space and then gave McBride so much space. And neither of them could capitalize on that. Right, half time, nil nil. We honestly should be 1 0 up. McBride should have really finished that chance that he had, and he just didn't, so... Yeah, I guess we're, uh... Well, look, we're not losing. There we go, positivity. We're not losing. Ah, Cruz has been blocked from getting to that ball. I'd argue that's a fucking foul, but... You know, EA like to see things differently when it's against their players.
All right, gamers. I'm not sure if the mic was muted for those last two games, but it was certainly muted when I was um, sorting out the players, stats, and all that. Alrighty. So let's uh, let's get into the stats. So most appearances. These are the awards for the season, by the way, if you haven't um, been following. So Cardona got 47 appearances. That, he's played every competition or every game that we had this season. Cardona was in it. Then Cruz with 45, and then George McBride. With 44. He's also joined with Ebiseli as well on that. In terms of most goals, it's going to be a fun one. We have George McBride with 26, Fernandez with 14, and Cruz with 11. In terms of assists, it's a similar story. We have, actually, no, hold on, goal of the season. So I had six to choose from, and I decided to go with George McBride versus Sharon in episode three. Now, of course, we had five other fantastic goals, but I decided to go with that one just, like, it was very tough, so I just kind of just picked a random one. So, that's what we've gone with. Yeah, anyway, most assists, George McBride with 17, Angel Fernandez with 10, and Adam Finley with 6. And assists of the season, we only have one option. It's Fessy Epizeli, who passed to John Duffy versus Finn Harps in episode 6. It was a nice pass as well. Clean sheets, we only have one, one guy that's eligible. And that is Javier Cardona, who went and got 17 clean sheets for the season. Only goalkeeper that we have, so he was obviously going to win it. He could have won, and he'd still win that one. So that's interesting. In terms of the highest average rating, we have Angel Fernandez with 6.94. Then in second place, George McBride with 6.91. And then in third place, with 6.84, we have, where is he? Correa. Yeah, cool. There you go. So... Based off that, man of the matches actually. Alright, we'll start from the bottom and work our way up. There's 10 options to choose from. George McCauley in 10th place with 7.4. Pierce Mullen in 9th with 7.5. Paul Kennedy in 8th with 7.7. Angel Fernandez in 7th with 8.5. Patrick Rooney in 6th with 13.5. Uh, Jemmy Cruz in 5th with 14.9. Liam Morrissey in 4th with 15.3. Bessie Ebiseli in 3rd with 15.7. And this is where it explodes. In 2nd place, we have Javier Cardona with 52.2. And in 1st place, we have George McBride with 69 giggity.5. So, not only is George McBride the vice captain for next season, but he was also involved in the most awards, which means that he is our player of the season, which means he's also captain for next season. So, the vice captaincy is kind of just a free-for-all next season. So, yeah, cool. Alrighty, lads, I'm going to leave it there. We managed to keep our jobs somehow. Uh, I'm going to keep an eye on the long reports. In fact, you know what, we'll check on them now while we're here. But I don't think anyone's gone up in rating. We'll probably find out when they return. No, yeah, McShane did. And so did Neil. Yeah, uh, and McDonald. Alright, start of season four, I'll be making sure we still have our youth players and that the game just didn't decide to kick them out of the club and make them free agents. Alright, got a lot of editing to do. Got two videos now that I need to get sorted. Right, lads, I'm gone. I'll see you in season four, which should be up in a week's time. All right, I'll talk to you.